folks. Another quality Rainier. I'm not buying Pass Blue Ribbon right now. Because all the cans look weird. They got all this music stuff on them. They got like some dude with like a mohawk. I, it's not Pass Blue Ribbon. Beer tastes the same in it, which is actually the most important part. But the can looks all messed up. I don't even want to deal with it. But Rainier has never had a special can except for they have the holiday ones. Which I like holiday. I like Christmas time, so that's a good one. Uh, yeah, I went down and played locals today. Didn't do too good with Vendry. Went 2 2. I'm going to have to restyle that deck. I got a regional next Saturday, a week from today. I'm going to have to try to figure out what to do with the deck, you know. I mean, it's got moments of brilliance, but most of the time it's just pretty bad, you know. I mean, about half the time it's bad, half the time it's okay. I'm gonna have to really look in to see what what I can do with the deck and try a little bit better, I guess. It's gonna be tough, you know. I mean, it's just basically this is gonna be a sure new zombie deck, you know. I gotta work on some stuff there. One two two, like I said, I beat Cosmo, then I lost to True Draco, then I lost to World Chalice, and then I beat Monarch. So, I lost the two newer decks and beat the two older decks. It's good. This rain here is always so good. It is raining for the first time in a month here in Ravensdale. It hadn't rained in Seattle for about 55 days, they said. It always rains more in Ravensdale because of the mountains. You know, It's still smoky out, but hopefully this rain will get the smoke out so the air quality will improve. What am I here for? You're like, damn it, get to the Yu-Gi-Oh! Get to Yu-Gi! I always do that. Well, today it's going to be the booster, the blister packs that I'll go down to Walmart, cut right on in there, and I pick them all up, and I've got 23 today. Uh, good rarity, actually. Uh, I've got three of Fusion Forcers. Yeah, they still have some Fusion Forcers. These are like, these are pretty fucked up, though. I mean, the, they're all bent and everything. The packs inside look good. Man, if I can pull an invocation, that'd be so ridiculously sick. Oh, my God. And then I got, uh, I don't know how many each one I got. I got six Battle of Legend, Light's Revenge. Going to try and get a Minerva. I won't complain if I get an Omega. That's a pretty hot card. Uh, and then I got... Uh, six. Oh, Jesus. Just dropped him. I got him. Six. Maximum Crisis this is, of course, the really good one where you can hope to get either a, uh, uh, Ash Blossom or, of course, a, uh, Dragonic Diagram, which will probably be limited pretty soon. And then, for the first time ever, yes, indeed, I have... Eight packs of Code the Duelist, the new one. Yeah, I always like getting the first time whenever you get uh, the newest set. And uh, actually, that's the first time, too, Battle of Legend I've ever gotten a blister pack. But yeah, going down to Walmart. Let's see. Uh, Walmart usually doesn't let me down. I bet you I'll get one really valuable card. So I'm going to get Firewall Dragon out of this. That would be super, super sick. I'd love to get a Firewall Dragon. I pulled one out of the last box. So, ugh. Yeah, working on them Vendreds. Waiting for Proxy Dragon to come out. That way I can play ABC again with relative ease. Uh, ABC and OCG will not work here in TCG because for whatever reason they're obsessed with set rotation and chicken game. Of course, chicken game's at three over an OCG. It's at zero here, quite the difference. So they just always, with ABC, they just throw in uh, you know, set rotation block out their opponent's field zone, and they get their, themselves a chicken game. You know, so uh, the only thing we can I can think of is there, or the, we can use here is the cock-a-doodle-doo, and you make it with, uh, you get get it to use to uh, make Ancient Fairy Dragon, you get to basically have two Union Hangers in one turn, which is pretty cool. Alright, so it's going to take me a while to open up all these. You know, it actually takes me like a good 10 minutes sometimes. So I'm going to head over yonder. I'm going to open up all these blister packs. And I'm going to drink some more beer in the process. Go get a little more drunk. 
because you know get drunk and uh, folks glad it's raining got rain here here glad it's raining with a casino tonight too I only lost like 60 bucks you know that's always a good night when you're at the casino for like six hours and you lose sixty dollars I always have fun at the casino I love the casino and uh, guys remember when it's raining and it hasn't rained in a while the roads will be slick because all the oil on it so always take a little more time chain up if you gotta chain up because there's slick oil on the road and uh, please always remember to get drunk all right, let's get on in here. Open them all up. So we got the Fusion Forcers, Battle of Legends Light Revenge, Maximum Crisis, and Co. The Duelist, and of course this tasty beer. Mm. All right, it's twenty-three packs. Good selection here. All right, come on. Invocation. Invoke Macaw would be pretty sick too. Here's Solar Nutrient, Super Solar Nutrient. Pretty play fly trap, fluffle owl, refusion, and magical meltdown. That's actually a really good one to get. Uh, I guess invoked is still pretty good during link format. I don't know how, but whatever. Edge imp sabers. Are we ever gonna see fluffles again? Edge imp sabers, preda pruning, preda planet, fusion substitute, and fluffle octopus. Pretty cute. I don't know if I ever am. I mean, Link Summoning's killed a lot of decks, and I think Fluffles is definitely one. Instant Fusion's probably the best super to pull out of this. Good old Instant Fusion. Miracle Fertilizer, Polymerization, Mark of the Rose, and Preta Plant, Spinodania. I have never, ever played against a Preta Plant. I did once on Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro. Alright, let's go for Minerva here. That would be extra sick. Five Rainbow Magician. What? Vanny's Fiend. Forgot he's in there. Judgment Dragon, Super Heavy Samurai Helper, and. Hey, that's, yeah, Helper, and Gladiator Beast Tamer Editor. The Gladiator Beast. Am I ever going to see any of those again? People are getting psyched for uh, Six Samurai. I know people want to play that. Uh, Sadion Raiden. That's a good one. Witch of the Black Forest reprint just for its errata. Wolf, Lightsworn Beast, and Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon. I'll put that down here. Let me go ahead and uh, read Crystal Wing for those of you who are unfamiliar with its mighty text. Uh, once per turn, when another monster's effect is activated, quick effect, you can negate the activation. If you do destroy that monster, and if you do, this card gains attack equal to destroyed monster's original attack until the end of this turn. If this card battles an opponent's level 5 or higher monster during damage calculation, this card gains attack equal to the card current attack of the opponent's monster. It is battling during that damage calculation only. So that is the permanent one, I believe. I think that's a, it gets that attack permanently. If I'm not mistaken, pack is stuck to the other pack. Still trying to get that Minerva. I did pull one. Celestia, Neo Galaxy Ice Photon Dragon. That's interesting. That was reprinted. Garoth, Gaia Dragon, and Time Maiden. Man, I didn't get this one. Okay, I'm going to have to read this because I never, out of two boxes, I never pulled this. Okay. If you control no monster, you can build some of this special summon this card from your hand. This card can be treated as two tributes or a tribute summon of a Time Lord monster. You can tribute this card, add one Time Lord monster with zero attack from your deck to your hand. You can banish this card from your grave or special summon one Time Lord with. Monster with zero attack from your deck and ignoring its summoning conditions. You cannot special summon other monster in turn. You have to activate this card. Man, it's got a lot of effects. Holy hell. That's like a Dante. You know how many effects it's got? We got here Super King Dark Armageddon. Solar Recharge is a good one. Odd Eyes Dissolver. I don't remember getting that one. Glider Beast and Dabata and the Phantom Knights of Breaksword. Sick. It's amazing how cheap that card is now. Ah. Crystal is in this too, right? Crystal is worth like a dollar out of this. Pretty insane how valueless Crystal is. Elmo Hero Nova Master. Galaxy Solar, that's a good one. Super Heavy Samurai Helper, Performable Odd Eyes Dissolver, and Double Evolution Bill. Get high. This is actually one of the best alters of whole Galaxy Soldier. Alright, last pack. Uh, Battle of the Legend. Let's go for the Minerva. Got a Raid Raptor Rudder Strix. 
Rainbow Magician, uh, Super Doom King, Bright Armageddon, Bujente Sukiomi, and the, another Phantom Knights of Break Sword. Two of them. Damn. All right, let's go Ash Blossom from this. Come on, Ash Blossom. That's what I want to see. Down on Mist Howling. Prevalent Darling and Cobra from Balcoin Dragon. And I did get a secret rare. Supreme King Dragon Zark. Which I guess this guy is becoming popular. Uh, go ahead and read. My God, this is so much text. All right. Fusion, Synchro, and XYZ monsters your opponent controls cannot activate their effects. Once per turn, when your opponent adds a card from adds a cards from their deck to their hand, except during the draw phase or the damage step, you can destroy that cards. Four dragon type monsters, one fusion, one synchro, one XYZ, and one pendulum. Must be fusion summoned, cannot be special summoned by other ways. If this card is special summoned, destroy all cards your opponent controls. Cannot be destroyed by your opponent's card effects. Your opponent cannot target this card with card effects. When this card destroys opponent monster by battle, you can special summon one Supreme King Dragon monster from your deck or extra deck. If this card is in the monster zone, it's destroyed by battle or card effect. You can place this card in your pendulum zone. Jesus Christ. I am winded. Is that for war? I don't even remember that card. Is that for war? I watched that one damn movie in the theater, War for Them Apes. Oh, I did get OTS Pack 5 for the first time today, and I managed to pull an ultimate. I pulled a Whiptail, which is like my least one I wanted. Bubba Boon. The new Performer Paul Sky Pupil, and another True King of Call Calamities. I say another because, you know, I think that's the most common super I pulled from this set. So, not bad. One secret so far. Keep it up, Walmart. Cataroos, the worst Zodiac monster. Bow, ba, boom, Bug Signal, Darlington Cobra, Dark Contract with a Turn, and True King's Return. All right, there's an Ultra. Go ahead and read this. This card's hella broken and meta. If this card is sent from the Spell and Trap Card Zone to the Graveyard, you can target one monster on the field destroy. You cannot activate the following effects of True King's Return in the same chain. You can target one True Draco or True King monster in your graveyard. Special Summon in a defense position. All for the rest of this turn, you cannot Special Summon. During your opponent's main phase, you can immediately, after this effect resolves, tribute summon one true Draco or true king monster face up. You can only use each effect of true king's return once per turn. That card's broken, man. It's so good. Whoa. Magician's left hand, DDD Ghost. Mad good. Uh, tr true King's True Draco has got to be one of the most annoying decks I've ever played against. It's just it's hard to pin them down, you know, because they got so many effects going off when they tribute summon Magician's Right Hand, Rescue, Kaiser Sea Snake, Spiral Gear, Last Resort, and Subterra Fiendus. Subterra is destroyed by Link Summoning; they don't even work anymore. Oh, I got Magician's Left and Right Hand. Check that out in the same pack. There they are, Left Hand, Right Hand. That's cool. I don't know if I ever had that happen before. I probably did, just didn't notice. All right. Two more packs of Maximum Crisis. Another right hand. Now I have to do left foot, right foot. Fossil Glacier, Baba Boon. Man, it seems like Spiral Dragon and Zephrath. Uh, Spiral Power, Apocalypse, Zephra War. War for them apes. I wish they called it that instead of War for Planet of the Apes. Should have just called it War for them apes. That'd be hilarious. All right, last pack of Maximum Crisis. The Kaiser Sea Snake. True Draco, this is a super. Now in OTS 5, Turquoise Warbler. Pendulum Switch. And True Draco Heritage. All right, this is another really good one. Broken. It's like a uh, damn old... Uh, uh, Super Rejuvenation, which is still banned in OCG. Uh, during your main phase, you can draw cards equal to the number of True Draco and True King card types, Monster Spell, and Traps sent from the field to the graveyard this turn. During your main phase, you can immediately after this effect resolves, Tribute Summon one True Draco or True King Monster face up. If this card is sent from the Spell and Trap Zone to the graveyard, carry one Spell or Trap card on the field destroy. You can only use each effect of True Draco Heritage once per turn. So no diagram, but I'll take two Ultras, and there's Firecracker and Hammer Kong. Oh, I'll take two Ultras and a Secret. 
You know, it's what we do. All right, here we go. Code of the Duelist. Firewall Dragon, please. There's one Ultra that's going way up in price. It's the True Chalice, the little dragon. He's like gnawing on something. Let's see if I can get a hold of that. All right, Passing Glider, Galaxy Worm, World Legacy, Zombina, uh, Aram, the World Chalice, Blade Master, and Supreme King, Dragon, Starving Venom. Twilight Twin Dragons, Crown. I kind of like this deck. World Chalice, pretty cool. Ugh, this thing's awful. F.A. It's like U.A.'s inside, like, uh, F-Zero cars. World Chalice, I played that today. It's pretty obnoxious, man. That's all I can tell you. It's like, Jesus Christ. So much summoning. It looks cool, but I'm a little scared to play it because it's just mostly, uh, normal monsters. Grand Prix, Jack Wyvern, Cyber's Wizard, World Legacy. There's another one of those. Uh... World Chalice. Ancient Gear Ultimate Pound, which is interesting because it was supposed to be it was an ultra rare magazine promo in Japan. More code the duelist. More I, I keep wanting to call it COD, like Call of Duty. They should have just called it that, like COD, like C O D D. World Galaxy World Legacy Landmark. Zombina. Oh, rescue ferret. Nice. I got a secret rare. Let's go ahead and read this beast. This What's he got on? He's got a helmet like all of them do, but he's got like some sort of like, I, I, I guess it's more cave gear. You can shuffle this card you control into the deck. Special summon monsters from your deck, except Rescue Ferret, whose total levels equal six to your zones at a link monsters points to. Okay, you already have to have a link monster to use this. But those summon monsters have their effects negate. The also destroy them during the end phase. You can only use this effect to Rescue Ferret once per So to use this, you've already got to have a link monster established. Okay. Okay. Man, that's sick. I never pulled that before. Rescue Ferret. Cool. Walmart never lets me down. I'm pulling some pretty good stuff. Uh, yeah. Uh, Twilight Cloth. Ooh, I love the artwork on this. Perry Knights. Looks kind of like Chun-Li. Chun-Ri. Alright, more Code of the Duelist. More Cad. I guess it's cocked it. Whoa, whoa. Oh, whoa. Oh. Uh. Epic fail. I uh, knocked over the stack. Oh, well, I'll get that later. Revenants. Backup secretary, Gogo Arista. Look at that. Another ultra. Lee, the world chalice fairy. Sick. Uh, if this card is normal, supposed to summon, you can add one world chalice monster from your deck to your hand. If this card is in your graveyard, you can send one monster from your hand in your field to the graveyard to add this card to your hand. You can only use each effect of Lee, the world chalice fairy, once per turn. I like the name of this one, Blind Obliteration. Roll a six-sided die twice and destroy all face of monsters level slash ranks lower than that total roll. Doesn't work on links. You think of a card printed in the first link one. I got like that. I got them back to back. Treasure pan Treasure Panda, Purple Trump Panda, uh, Donald Trump. Uh, I that happened before on one pack too. Got them back to back. What's this one? Three strikes barrier. If your opponent controls exactly three cards, okay, I remember that one. And that card's like impossible because I have exactly three. I guess you can flip it, it's a chain. So as soon as they put that third card on the field, you're like, all righty, here we go. All right, so doing pretty good here. Uh, Launcher Commander, man, it's like Launcher Spider. World Legacy's Heart. This card's pretty broken too. Uh, DD Vice Typhoon, Emergency Rescue, whatever. Cracking Dragon and Vendred Hound Horde, the sneak preview. Cards, Hack Worm, Crowned by the World Chalice, Prior Plant, ugh, so gross. Bansagori. All right, I still got three packs of Code the Duelist. Stuck together, give me some beer. Yeah. Rainier since 1878. That's older than Hitler. <laughs> All right. Uh, backup Secretary, go, go, go. Launcher Commander, World Legacy Hark. Arum, the World Chalice Blade Master, and Supreme King Dragon Dark Rebellion. Wicked Stack Reviver. What is this? Another Cyber's Twilight Twin Dragons. World Chalice. How ridiculous. It was good. Destiny Hero Dangerous. Cool name. Jack Wiver and Speed Roy Passion. Oh, and a Trickstar Holly Angel. I am just going crazy on these. Uh, two Trickstar Monsters, which i never seen a Trickstar deck make this. Each time a Trickstar Monster is normal... 
or special summon to a zone this card points to. Inflict 200 damage to your opponent. Trickstar monsters this card points to cannot be destroyed by battle or card effects. If your opponent gains, if your opponent takes damage by a Trickstar monster effect, this card gains attack equal to the damage they took till the end of this turn. Pretty good. Blind Obliteration. Ultimate Pound, Wicked, Twilight Twin Dragon, Crown by the World Child. I keep getting this one. It's a lot of that one. All right, last best hope. Get a Firewall Dragon. That'd be so sick, a Firewall Dragon. All right, here we go. Can I make this even better? How many cards do I got that I consider good? I kept that Crystal Wing up there, so one, two, three, four, five, six. That's six, right? Yeah, six. Destiny Hero Dangerous, Jack Wyvern, Speedroy, Passing Glider, oh, a Cybers Wizard, and the Hound Horde. Unable to get the Firewall Dragon. Man, see, I got another one. That must be the easiest common to get. So pretty damn good here, if I got, can't say so for myself. Trickstar Holly Angel, Lee the World Chalice, Rescue Ferret, True Draco Heritage, True King's Returns, Crinking Zark, Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon from uh, Battle Legend. That's, that's a good haul right there. That's a real damn good haul. I'll take that any damn day of the week. Yeah, buddy. Folks, if you enjoyed the video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more of this quality content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And then also hit that little bell icon, you know, for whom the bell tolls. It'll let you know whenever I upload the quality content. And uh, you can watch it immediately on demand, on the go, whenever the hell you need to. You're taking that bus ride to Wendy's, you know, with that delicious double stack and the vanilla frosty. You know, you go down in there and you're like, I'm going to take the bus to Wendy's today. And you go and you get it and you're like, you know what, this bus ride's a little long. What am I going to do to fill the time? And you're like, I'm going to watch that uh, Last Best Hope guy. You know, that he's always a little bit drunk when he does them, always making me giggle, you know. Uh, that'll be good. So, folks, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I know I did. I always enjoy opening up blister packs from Walmart. And, uh, I'm going to have to see what I can do with Vendred, or I'm going to play something else for the regional. I don't want to go to the regional 0 and 8, you know. That'd be a terrible fucking experience. So, guys, I will... See you in a couple days, and peace!